Okay, everypony. As you know, the adorable fairy creatures known as Breezies are about to come through Ponyville. to ride that breeze to their native land. Did I mention how tiny they are? So tiny. I was thinking we could do a special breezy cheer. I love cheers! But these cheers should be quiet cheers. We don't want to startle them. They need to be able to concentrate. Why don't we try it? You can do it, breezies. You can do it, breezies! Sorry, Fluttershy. I had no idea how hard it was to do a cheer quietly. Oh, it's okay. Quiet doesn't come naturally for every pony. Let's try it again. You can do it, Breezies! Perhaps just a little bit quieter. You can do it, Breezies! Just a little quieter. You can do it, Breezies! Perfect! Oh, um, I mean, yay. I don't understand is why they need the Pegasi to make a breeze for them. Well, you see, it's the breeze that activates the Breezy's magic, and that magic protects the pollen they're carrying from being destroyed. So, no breeze means no magic means the pollen goes bad? That's right, and they only have two days to get that pollen back before the portal to their home closes. That's why it's ever so important that we help them make their way through Ponyville safely. We certainly wouldn't want to scare them and divert them from their path. Now you understand. <laughs> you certainly know a lot about them. Oh, thank you. I went to see them gathering their pollen in Western Equestria. Um, Rarity, I uh, hate to weigh in with you when it comes to fashion, but... Oh, there's too much purple on this, isn't there? I knew it! But Twilight refused to admit it. What? I... Oh, no, 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 no. It's the perfect amount of purple. It's just that there's an awful lot of sequins on your jacket. Oh, darling, please. One can never have too many sequins. <laughs> you can if they reflect the sun and the light catches a group of breezies right in their eyes and blinds them long enough to get them off their course so they never get home. I stand corrected. I suppose there is the rare instance when one can have too many sequins. I'll just take off my jacket. I suppose this won't do either? Every pony, it's time. Please welcome the Breezies! They're as cute as Apple Bloom on the day she was born. Would you look at those adorable little packs they carry their pollen in? Mary, there's an apple! So cute! Can't take it! <sighs> Pinkie Pie, can I hop on you so I can see the breezies? to both sets of breezies. What if we speed it up? Then the first group will be going too fast and we'll get separated from each other.
Oh, I understand the language of all kinds of creatures. Oh, he must be so proud. And you speak my language too? I can't. This lot can only understand you. Clearly, they're not the brightest bunch around. <laughs> We couldn't get a breeze going that would get them back to the others. Oh, it's not your fault. I, for one, am very proud of you, Fluttershy. Leaping into action like that. I feel like I should design you a special hero's gown. <laughs> or a, a sash. At least a sash. Okay, okay, okay. I know what you're all thinking. Why don't you just say it? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> this is all my fault. I'm so, so sorry. <laughs> oh, Spike. It's okay. It could have happened to any one of us. Okay. Thank you. Uh, I'm just gonna stay over here. So, Fluttershy, you want us to get the breeze going again so these little guys can get a move on? Maybe we should wait just a moment or so. We've been through so much. Just give me the word when you think they're ready. Twirly, you look like you need a blanket. So, Kim, uh, no problem. My blanket? Oh, did you need some more water? Now, who else needed a hoof knitted sweater? Hi there! Can we come in? Oh, of course. But watch your step. Oop. Sorry about that, little one. We just wanted to see if you thought the Breezies were ready to give it another try. Has it been an hour already? Oh my goodness. Time flies when you're making sure little creatures don't feel that you're abandoning them to the cruel world. But they're not going to a cruel world, right? They're going home. Oh yes, that's right. <laughs> On second thought, I don't think they're quite ready. Uh, what did he say? I'd rather not say. Okay, well, I'm sure you know what you're doing. No one knows rare magical creatures like you do. We'll just wait for your word. Thank you. I'll be in touch very soon. We need to go now, or we will never get home. I wish we did not need that stupid breeze to activate our magic, or I would just force you all to fly home right now. Why do we have to need magic to keep our pollen safe? Now, Sea Breeze. Why are you giving in to these wimps? If they had not been so scared in the first place, this never would have happened. Well, that is just not true, Sea Breeze. It was because of a leaf, and you know that. Oh, bullies! They have no idea what they are doing out there. Like you said, we need as much time as we can get because they are so incompetent. Well, I didn't say that exactly, now did I? Huh. Oh, well, maybe a snack will lighten the mood. Moonfarzen, <laughs> uh, you're excused. Well, my breezies, I think we can all agree that now that you've eaten and you have a little energy going in your breezy bodies, you're strong enough to face the breeze. I've loved having you here, and I hope I've made you all feel loved and special. But you have to go. No pony here will deny that. There is nothing special about these losers. They cannot handle a simple breeze home. If they could just stick with the program and listen to me, we would be safe. Confusing pep talk, but nonetheless, I do know that if you don't leave soon, you may never make it back, and that would be terrible. Monkey Marsh Converter. Monkey Marsh Converter. 
Timbuktu. I had no idea you all have colds. Really? All of you? Yeah. <laughs> oh dear. I can't let you go out there sick. What kind of a friend would I be if I made you go now? <laughs> on their home. Oh, yes. I mean, uh, not quite. Um, maybe just a few more minutes? Uh, all right. We wait too much longer. We'll have to create such a strong breeze. It may be more than they can handle. We just have to trust Fluttershy. She must know what she's doing. <laughs> has a point. I think it's time for me to get Rainbow Dash and her friends so they can create the breeze for you to get home. <laughs> mm, you're all awfully anxious. Mm, I don't want you to feel abandoned or that I wasn't the most kind host I could possibly be. Oh yes, that does make sense. Seabreeze, do you think you could wait just a couple more hours? Seabreeze? Seabreeze! Has anybody seen Seabreeze? <gasps> Where is he going? Oh, there's no way he can handle being out there on his own. Perhaps a bee. Excuse me! I have done nothing but be kind, but I guess that is not working. You bees know better than to hurt a helpless breezy. I demand that you go away now, or you'll have to answer to me. Thank you, Lynn. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for coming after me. Of course. You could have gotten seriously hurt out there. Ponyville is much too dangerous for you. One tiny acorn is a threat. Yeah, I know. That is one reason why I have been trying to get us to go from the beginning. Oh, my goodness. I was just trying not to hurt any creature's feelings. My displays of kindness may have cost you everything. Time is running out, and you may never make it home. That is exactly what I have been telling all of them, but they do not listen to me. No Breezy ever listens to me! Seabreeze, I understand your feelings are hurt, but it's hard for them to hear you when you're shouting and being mean. The message doesn't get across. But what about those bees? You were not nice to them, and that was the only way they listened. Yes, but they had to go. And they wouldn't listen to me any other way. We need to go. Now! My dear Breezies, 
I had to rescue Seabreeze from serious harm. And now I know more than ever that you must leave before it's too late. You would never survive in Ponyville. I can't help you anymore. In fact, I wasn't helping you at all by being nice. But the truth of the matter is that I must be firm. You must go now. started their journey, there was more of them to face the breeze together. I've been studying an old spell book from the castle of the two sisters. There's a spell that I think could help us. This is probably gonna feel a little funny at first, but you're gonna have to trust me. I love new ideas that make me feel funny at first! with the breezes have helped me to see that kindness can take many forms and sometimes being too kind can actually keep a friend from doing what they need to do pushing them away may seem cruel but it's sometimes the kindest thing you can do Chance. You sure? What about a dragon? No? It doesn't have 